So whilst we've been eliminated from the round three of the FA Cup, I'm here with RD12. Um, yeah, we're, we're, we're out to not in the forest, mate. What do you think about the game? I'm, I'm guess, guessing you're fuming like I am, but yeah, what do you think? It was just shit. From minute one to 90, there was just no control of that game whatsoever. And we had half of our first team out as well. That's just the mad thing about it, that we had half of our first team out tonight and we just did not show up whatsoever. Yeah, you know, we, we have players like, you know, Gabriel Martinelli, Saka, Odegaard, uh, you know, Tierney. And now I want to ask you, why, why did Nuno Tavares, you know, come off in the 35th minute? Uh, because was it an injury? I mean, I looked at it and I think because his reaction, he threw, he threw the gloves on the floor and all that. I don't know why he uh, came off. He obviously brought Kieran uh, Tierney. Uh, I don't know. It was, it was it was probably because it was quite poor, but it was yeah, it was really really poor. And obviously, like right at the end, man, uh, I think we got what we deserved. You know, I don't know who scored for them. Was it um, who scored for them? It was uh, Sumachi, wasn't it? The captain. I think. Yeah, Graban, I think. Yeah, that's it. Um, and then the manager decides to bring on Kalasanac. We needed a goal, yeah, and he brings on Kalasanac. I mean, what do you make of I'm... that? I thought that was absolutely shocking. <laughs> I mean, like, I, I just don't care whether, you know, if you even if you bring on, like, someone like Hutchinson or, like, BRF, yeah. like, from the academy, mm. they'll, they'll do a fucking better job than Kalasinac, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Like, like what would he do? I think he was playing, like, right back when he came on. Literally, because he came off the segue. Yeah. Yeah. He just came off the segue. Right. We need a goal, right? I think we had, uh, we had like, like you said, we had Hutchinson on the bench. We had that Salah Giza. We had that... Um, I've, uh, I don't know who else what there was, but um, oh mate, I'm just so embarrassed. Literally, why is it why it's not in the forest as well? You know, like one know. out of twenty five years, yeah, and that one out of twenty five was not in the forest, and then once again it's them again, and it's like I thought we could actually go find this Cup as well. I was looking forward to see, you know, we would, I think we who would we play next? It would have been Leicester, wasn't it? I think if yeah, it was draw, it was it's going to be Leicester. So I was looking forward to that, and we just went out there today, right? There's, there's no urgency from, from the players whatsoever. After performing really well against Manchester City, by the way, I know it's a, not really, you know, it, it was like a different team, but I thought that team out there today was enough to at least be on the forest. I mean, like, oh, it's just such a joke. Um, yeah, like, where do we go from here, man? Obviously, no FA Cup. We've got to focus on the league now and I've maybe done it because of the Cowboy Cup. What do you think? I mean, if, if we can't beat Nottingham Forest, then what do you think it's going to look like if we are in the Champions League? Yeah, and the fact that we've got Liverpool coming up in the Carabao Cup and we probably will play a similar team. I don't know if we'll go really strong because we've got Spurs as well in the North London derby, mate. We've got some really tough games. Um, if, you, if you want, we can do some player ratings and then uh, we do it for both of us. So, um, who, what do you think of it today? I mean, had, had a chance to prove himself, right? Do you think he proved himself? Who? Uh, Burn Leno in goal. See, Ramsdale's number one now and all that. Um, well, very surprising. He actually made some good saves, if I'm being honest. Mm. Like the free kick. Um, I don't think he should have done a, anything about the goal. I mean, that first goal was an example of, like, just got the Garden Gnome FC, like, on sleeping yeah. pills. You get what I mean, you know? Yeah. It's just it Rob Holding. To be fair, he didn't even have a bad game, but again, it's just crap. But Leno was all right. I, I thought Cedric was absolutely shit, if I'm being honest. Oh, yeah, no. Got but the ball just time. coming off him left, right, and centre. And, you know, you you know, know uh, what, what's, what's, what's number two? Uh, it was that Spence geezer, yeah? Literally ripping <laughs> our defence up. He, he's, he's I know. Like, where did he play? Was he, was he right back or something? Or was he yeah. playing midfield? I think he's right back, can't he? We let him fucking do us all up. It's just yeah, I mean, I mean, I mean, you know, the the the, the guy that was, um, I think his name was like Kafu or someone. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, yeah it was he played like Kafu, didn't he? he just nah. <laughs> yeah. But, but was just, like, oh god. Yeah. What What did you make of? I mean, I, I'm glad that Charlie Casino played. What did you make of him? I thought. I thought, I, I thought it was pretty good, to be honest. I thought he was all right, yeah. He was decent. And, and you know, he, had, he was playing alongside the Conga. I thought was just fan average, I'm being honest, mate. And then we had a really good attack as well. Saka, Odegaard, Martinelli. 
they just didn't, they just didn't know. And Ketty, I mean, how did you miss that chance? Like, I don't forgot when it was, he blasted it over the bar. It was just like something really lacking today. I don't know what it was. I'm, I'm, I'm just fed up of like, what, well, well, actually, no, I'm really, really excited to just finally not see Enketty at this club anymore because yeah. I'm fed up with this man just playing him every single time. Yeah, play him in the Carabao Cup, but mm. you know, if you look at the likes of Leicester, the likes of yeah. Dakar and, you know, Man United, despite how bad they are right now, you know, Cavani up top as a backup for Ronaldo. If they get the chance to let Nketiah had, then they score that chance. The ball actually almost went out for a throw-in. Yeah, we, we, desperately need, we desperately need a striker as well. I mean, who who, who would be your ideal striker um, to come in January? Because I think we need someone desperately, mate. Flahovic. Who would you go for? Flahovic. Flahovic, yeah. You know, we've got, we've got Val, uh, Valovic, you've got, um, who's the other geezer? Isaac, uh, apparently Luka Jovic as well. I mean, oh, I don't know about him. And then you've got, um, who's the other one? Uh, Calvert-Lewin. Calvert yeah, that's it. And then, you know, obviously, I think we just need, we need a new striker. I think we need a new... Um, we need uh, two. Two new strikers. Obviously, Lacazette goes. Yeah, one, two. It was because if Lacazette goes, right, yeah. and then Ketia goes... Where's Balogun got... by any chance? Balogun, yeah, he went... Balogun won't even on the bench. I think he's he's gone, mate. I think he's gonna go on loan yeah. to Middlesbrough. Like, so if he ends up smashing well. it at Middlesbrough, Middlesbrough yeah. are gonna be knocking on the door, and then we'll end up having no chance, but um, no choice, sorry, to sell Balogun, and um, yeah, we'll have no strike I mean, at that point because the Bamian won't we, be. We also need yeah. a, a, a new lift builder because, like, obviously, parties at Afcon, right? And against Spurs, we've been playing Sambi La Congo and Granit Xhaka by the looks of things. Like, we need a new... I mean, there's people like Bruno... Uh, I don't know how his name. Is it Bruno Gamerez? Something yeah. like that. There's him. You've got uh, Renato Sanchez. I'll take any of them, mate, because we need it. Obviously, we lost our Coutinho. He went Villa. But Sambi La Congo and Xhaka, while parties at AFCON, right? I don't think it's going to work. El Nenny no. as well. It's not here, but like, AFCON as well. No, like, if, if, if Sambi La Conga can't control midfield. Like he's maybe like the main man to control that midfield because Patino's yeah. still young. Then how's he gonna control the midfield against Tottenham on yeah, Sunday? Exactly. exactly. So look look, they'll be licking their lips right now. Like yeah. you know, Son's apparently out for the game. So oh, that, really? that, that's not such a good but again Harry Kane's finding some more form. Um who else? Lucas is alright. I'm um, lost, mate. Plus, it's literally away as well. It's not at home. And the whole, last time we beat Spurs away was literally, God knows, I think it was like 26, 2015. So that, that yeah. worries me a lot. It Maybe it's the Northland and Derby round. The players will be fired up for it, hopefully. I'm hoping. Because, look, you know, I know today was shocking, but we better go and fix things against Spurs, yeah? Because if we lose that, if they beat us, right, I think they go, they go above us. In, and then that'll be top four gone as well, I think. So, like, yeah. I just think... Bro, he can't answer it, mate. You, he, right, you've got us at the FA Cup, right? You could maybe get us to the Carabao Cup final. Uh, probably, hopefully, be Chelsea, right? But after that, we've got to get past Liverpool. Now, now we've got to get us top four. Because if you don't, mate, then, mate, you've got to go. I think it's only... What, what do you think about Antetta, mate? Because like, fucking bring on Klasenac, mate. Well, we need a goal, right? Yeah, so, yeah. Not in the forest, mate. They're literally like... Where are they in the league table, by the way? I think they're like ninth. Yeah, ninth. Yeah. Right? <laughs> And the, the, no, no, the fact that um, he wasn't on the sideline for the Manchester City game and yeah. he played Elbow. so, so well. And then yeah. the first game, Arteta is back on the sideline. We go and we get, lose. we go and lose, and then we get no shots on target. No shots on target. Mate, it's, it's a championship club. An absolute disgrace. Who have also got a new manager in charge. Mate, so, what, what, what a disgrace, bro. Um, so yeah, um, thank you for coming on, bro. I really do appreciate it. Everyone go subscribe to Ad as well. Obviously, like your channel got terminated, didn't it? Um, yeah. Uh, you had like so many. You had like three, was it three hundred subscribers, and they've decided to terminate you. But uh, you, see, I've seen your chance videos, man. They they got like, your recent one got like six hundred views or whatever. Yeah. So yeah, I think you know you're getting subscribers. Now. I think you're are you on seventy subscribers now or something. Yeah, I think so.
Yeah, so everyone goes out to him. Thank you for coming on, man. Absolute disgrace performance from Arsenal. Getting knocked out of the FA Cup by Nottingham Forest. Would you believe it, mate? Um, yeah, smash out my Scarpianu. And I'll see you guys later.